Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Alex, and alongside me is another commentator, Vader. Hello, everyone, I'm commentator, Vader, and Toy the Dark And today, ladies and gentlemen, we're here today on a Wednesday, War Day, on Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Now, this is the first time we're actually having, we're actually having this. But due to yesterday effect, we have to have this fight. I really want to see how long this fight can actually happen. Mark McCloud and Ike, the fight, the sword fighter man, who had their first stage settlement like uh two weeks ago, right? And all of a sudden, ever, ever since then, they've been fighting nonstop. Fox already got two wins over Ike. Yes, last night, Ike got a win over Fox, and now he still wants to go after Fox. Why is that? Because Wolf beat him and he wants to be better than Fox? Man. Well, the definition is if Ike wins this fight, then this fight, then this fight will continue on until tomorrow. But if Fox wins this, then the fight is completely over. So that's why we call this a Wednesday War Day on a Wednesday. Well, this is the only fight that we can do, so now it's the only thing that we're going to be doing, right, Alex? Am I right? Well, yeah, technically you're not really wrong now. But still, don't get me wrong. Hey, look, I hate Fox McCall because he copied my, because he stole my name and replaced the war, the war, the word war into Fox. Like Star Fox. It's not Star Wars. It's Star Fox. But, but, but the thing is, he's a, he's a space, pi he's a space Fox pilot. So, you know, an Ike of Swords and, and, and yes, he got victories over Falco. He got victories over Link. Now Link got a payback against him in the World 1. And then now all of a sudden he decided to target Fox because he beat Falco. That doesn't make any sense. Well, it does because he tried to intimidate him by saying, Oh, he lost the wolf, so now he's going to lose to him. Hey, look. Whatever happens, happens, okay? This is a Wednesday war of whatever happens. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys are watching this, this is a one video, this is a one fight episode until tomorrow we'll be having our, we'll go back into our regular schedule, which will be a Thursday and Tuesday night rivalry. So, if you like this, please make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And, if, and hit the subscribe button. If you want to get more notifications about this, please make sure to hit the bell button. So, let's get on with this board game. It's going to be a Morphin match. It will, will, will it be the final or will it be continued? Fox the Cloud, take it on Ike. And it begins now. Here we go. No one doesn't get the attack right there, but Fox the Cloud draws the first attack to Ike. And already he's not even in a struggle. There goes the Slice. Good job with that maneuver. His defense is working flawlessly, but now he's trying to work on his offensive game. Ooh, good job with his air combination. He's trying to make sure that his defense is well. He's trying to make sure that the sword goes very well. Ooh, good job with that one. There we go. Ooh, good job. By, good job. Fox summoned out a weapon. Of course he's going to summon out a weapon. This is a Wizard War game. And besides, we're here at a place where... There's already an area where you can walk back. Fox McCloud and Ike are having this struggle right here, right now. Here we go. No good there. Ooh, freezes him in depth and froze in depth. Ooh, but good job with him with that one. Ooh, here comes the specialty. He's activated it. Ooh, good job with the slice and dice. He tried to get him with the slice and he got him with that one. Great Ethan got Fox. Ooh, and it looks like he loses the stock right after that. Ooh, good job by Fox! Well, he didn't waste no time here. He just had to get that kick out of him. And he gets him with the specialty! Fox is saying he got him with the specialty. He's gonna get him back with his specialty. Good job by Fox the Cloud getting that one going. Fox is not gonna lose. Fox is refusing to lose his rivalry war. And he doesn't want to continue it. He wanted to end. He wants Ike to realize that he cannot beat him. Ever since the day he gave you the Super Smash Bros. Raw, but you know what? Ike was by far the strongest. We're here at Cordaria right now. We're not at the castle. Ooh, good job by Fox. He is all charged up. Ooh. Oh! He's too slow with the sword trying to draw back. So Fox has to do that. There it goes. Ooh! A thump thump. Really? A thump? A thwomp? really have to use a dwarf for that one. Ooh, Fox McCloud was about to charge him up with that one to kind of attack. Oh my goodness, a set down on him. <laughs> Looks like Ike ain't gonna have no piece of re redemption any anytime soon. Ike is losing a bunch of power. Ike is losing a bunch of energy right now. Ooh. Uh oh. 
Fox got it. Ooh. And look at this. Oh my goodness. Looks like Fox is about to get the upper hand on Ike. I think Fox could actually knock him out of the platform. And he does. It affects it effect. You can see Wolf's R wing. You can see Wolf's movement right there. He's watching Ike. He's watching Ike. But no center. Woo! He got it with that one. Ike is trying to even things out with Fox. And I can see why. Because he doesn't want anything to go wrong. Ooh, back at the castle, Ike fell off. But that one, after he was trying to watch, make Wolf watch him in the fight. Because he's an idiot. That's why. You have to focus on the fight. As Bowser always once said, now become the top. We're back here after Ike took that. Oh, uh oh, he looks like he's about to go onto the screen. He got one stock left. One stock. One stock left. How long do you think this is going to happen? How long do you think this is going to last? Do you really think that Ike is really actually going to get a win over Fox as well? Fox is actually making this look easy for himself. He doesn't need anything. Ooh. Look at this. Ike is trying to use that star power to try to get uh over -oh, Foxy the first. No good there. Ike. Ooh, good job by Foxy. Oh, but Ike gets him. Ike gets him with a great Ethan. And he slices the dice and Fox in half. He goes right there and now there's two to one. Fox got two to one. Fox is, do is kicking him in midair. Ooh. And there we go. Ooh. Good dodge for do. I do I can do that one. Oh. They're both destroying the statue. I don't know why. Because they hate the statue. Obviously. Good job by Fox dodging that one. Ooh. I saw that one coming. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Looks like Fox is about to... Look at that. That was pretty cool. And look at this. Uh-oh. Oh no. That was the wrong thing. You became a sitting target to him, Ike. That was the wrong thing to do. Ooh. After the second redemption, Fox got him with that one. Look at this. He gets him with... Oh, and he gets him. Oh, no good there. Fox is trying to get him with that one. He got him cornered. Uh-oh. Ooh. Fox is cornered. No good there. In midair like that. Oh. Fox is in midair again. Ooh, he's metal now. Maybe he might have a chance. Ooh, no good there. Oh. He's going for the illusion. Ike is too slow to catch Fox. Oh! With a split! And it looks like Ike came back! Ike did came back. Oh, but Fox, Ethan is coming back to him. Oh, Ooh, this is actually going to turn out to be good. Looks like Ike is about to lose it. MP Hughes is cool. Fox is on a great, fo Fox is on his R wing. Oh, Fox is all the way up into the air. Oh, he goes flying. And it looks like this is his last time. If Fox has to do something here. Oh! A comeback, and it looks like it's over! The rivalry between Fox the Cloud and Ike is finally over. Can we put this to a rest now? The one take fight. That's finally over. Ike, I hate to say this, man, and I really hate to say this. But Fox is just better than you right now. Just give it up, man. You can't beat Fox. He's too fast for you. He's too. Quick for you, man. You got the muscle. You got the strong. You got the sword, sword and gold. But bronze cannot. I hate to say this. Bronze cannot beat speed. Because speed equals power, right? Wrong. The dark force equals power. Everything that consumes you inside your heart. Everything that consumes you. The dark force is always with you. And Fox has that. He just doesn't know it. Ike has that, he just doesn't know it. But his Dark Force is weak. Yeah, I, can, I can make him stronger. If he teams up with Bowser, then maybe he might have a chance. Yeah, I doubt that. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, just because today is Wednesday War Day, we're going to show one more match. Oh, great. One more match. Uh, what, what, what match?
match do we have to do? I mean, we already have to commentate on this one. What match do we have to commentate now? You'll see and find out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, our last match is going to be Sonic the Hedgehog taking on Wall. This is actually going to be amazing. So, Sonic the Hedgehog, the greatest former champ, the greatest uh, tourney champion, has decided to turn his head against Wolf. Wolf is supposed to be fighting one of the best, one of the best fighters ever, and obviously he can't even do that because obviously he's going against Sonic the Hedgehog, who clearly beat one of the toughest characters in our time, and he beat in Sonic, and he beat in Bowser just that one time, one time he beat in Bowser. Well, Sonic the Hedgehog is doing a fantastic job. He's keeping up his poser, but it's Wolf who's having trouble. Now, I guess Wolf's weakness is against speed. Fox has speed, and not even Fox gets speed. What makes you think that Sonic? Look at that! Look at that! He already gave him 126 damage, and this fight is considered with no item. Ooh. Look at that! Sonic the Hedgehog just went up into the air twice. How did he do that? Wolf gave him that kind of attack and a kind of. Head, so obviously that's how it happened. Well, Wolf is using his very quick witted ability. He's trying to. Ooh, good job by. Bob, ooh, good job by Sonic, dishing him out. Oh, that was just a weak thing. Look, they go still with a head job. Who freaking cares about that imps? I don't. Wolf falls again. Whoa! Did I just see Wolf fall again? That 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 that's impossible. How did Wolf fall? He's trying to go after Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Hedgehog is actually a good fighter right now. He's going Super Sonic to take down Wolf. Wolf is getting a beating from Super Sonic. Obviously, Wolf cannot even attempt to make an attack, but he did somehow. Look at that, the old Star Wolf gang. Leon, Pigma, Andrew, and Wolf himself. It's too bad in Star Fox Assault they have to be separated. Well, the only two who stayed, well, the only one who stayed with Wolf was actually Leon. Well, yeah, but Leon is like Falco, loyal to his friend because, you know, they're best buddies and stuff like that. So, imagine if Leon was actually the next, uh, fighter in Super Smash. Oh my goodness, that could be amazing. Then it will really be a Star Wolf versus Fo Star Fox team if Leon was actually in this. Sonic the Hedgehog, he's showing no mercies to Wolf. Odell to Wolf. This is a no items fight, and these two are actually going, and these two are actually taking the beat, and these two are actually going a, a battle to battle with each other. Whoa, 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 Sonic the Hedgehog almost fell off right there. He's going for the charge duck attack and going for the home and attack. There goes Wolf. He goes back onto the field. There we go. Ooh, a tackle right there. He goes Super Sonic, and there after that, here comes Wolf. Losing the stock right after that. Good job. How did Wolf get the stock right after that? It's morphing. We're here at Venom. Ooh! Now, this is actually turned out to be a good fight right now. Sonic the Hedgehog looks like he was conquering him, but now Wolf is trying to make, is trying to bounce back and try to conquer Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Hedgehog has been praised. Ever since his movie came out last month, he's been praised a lot. He became a champion, and then after that, he was praised for everything that he has done. And then after that, look what happened. No champion after that. Sooner or later, there is going to be a tourney, but we don't know when the tourney is going to happen. Oh! Uh-oh. He's trying to prove something to Fox here. I can see that. But he already had his fight with Fox, so obviously he's trying to look for the next, component, uh, next opponent. Well, he wants to look for the next opponent. That's what he's doing. And he looks like he's trying to find his next opponent by fighting Sonic the Hedgehog, who calls himself all... Calls himself all that. Just because you beat Bowser once doesn't mean that you can try to beat Wolf. Wolf is taking a beating from Super Sonic. Oh, and he dodges that last attack. If I'm telling you, if he didn't get that, if he didn't get those hits, then maybe Sonic the Hedgehog would have probably got away with that one. Ooh. He goes back onto the he goes back onto the stage. Oh, but Sonic the Hedgehog uses that one. Ooh. And there goes Sonic the Hedgehog. Go down, worth oh no good there. Sonic going back onto the going back onto the battlefield. Ooh. Ooh, there he goes. He goes for the back horse kick on Wolf. Oh, and a split! The same thing that Fox did earlier on Ice. The split. Obviously, the split is always the only thing that you that will save your life, obviously. 
And obviously, I'm gonna tell you guys this right here and right now. This is ridiculous. Oh! But now it's even it's getting even better because you know why? Wolf looks like he's about to lose himself and see the Sonic the Hedgehog mistake. Sonic the Hedgehog giving him 40% of damage. Wolf is trying to is trying to bounce back. He gets 42% of damage. Uh oh! Looks like Sonic and Wolf are eyeing each other for the greatest bash. Ooh! But fuck! But he dodges that one. Good job by Sonic the Hedgehog. Ooh! He gets him with that one. Ooh! He's trying to come back onto this one, and Wolf, it looks like he's taking a beating. Wolf is by far the toughest fighter. He will bounce back and try to win this. Ooh, but a split happens, and this, ooh, and it looks like this could be the end. Could it be the end, Vader? It is! Sonic the Hedgehog's last attempt, and he took down Wolf. And it looks like Sonic the Hedgehog, on a war day, started a rivalry with Wolf Odell. With Wolf Odell. Well, that's a darn shame for Wolf. Wolf was 3 and 0. Oh. Now he's 3 and 1. 3 and 1. 3 and 1. What the freak is that, man? Like 3. No, 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 no. How many fights did he win? Uh, depending on the tag team fight. Let's see. He's not 3 and 1 right now. Well, when it comes to solo, but when it comes to his fights, he's like, let's see. Let's see. 1, 2, then 3, then 4, and then 5. And now he's five and one. Whoa, 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 he's five and one. Yeah, I think Wolf and Ike when they teamed up, they beat Falco or Link twice. Then he beat Fox three times. So yeah, he's five and one. <laughs> he would have been five and zero oh right now. <laughs> well, he's not a rookie, so obviously that don't count. Okay, it does. You made your point. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of our game. My name is Alex. A long time. He's out on the commentator fans. Hey, thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and share, share this video with your friends. And stay, and make sure you stay, and make sure you join us tomorrow for our Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Rival Night Tuesday. Well, Thursday, actually. I am commentator fans. Hey, sorry, I don't really talk for you all. We're going to see these two tomorrow. They the Sonic and the Wolf Rivalry Force be with you all. We'll see these guys tomorrow. I bet you we are. Well, it depends on what kind of fight's going that down. But anyways, so long, ladies and gentlemen. And see you guys, at the, and see you guys at tomorrow's Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Rival Night.